this is a common question asked, you know, and this is just a, a regular Google search, but you know, it's this is uh, logical, uh, plain as day shit right here. People also ask, what are human rights violations against prisoners? The concern of human rights violators against prisoners is broad and complex, as it includes unjust sentencing. What's happening to Eric Brandt? That's the very first one, unjust sentencing. That's a that's a human rights violation, what they did to Eric Brandt over the judge's feelings of his scary words. The, the concern of human rights violations against prisoners is broad and complex, as it includes unjust sentencing, overcrowded prisons, which is happening everywhere, which always is happening and has been happening. They don't care about human rights violations. Prison guards and jail guards and booking agents and this and that are, oh, they're wicked and cruel and disgusting. Uh, physical and mental health of prisoners, they don't do that. They, they, um, tease people and, uh, it's just a fucking butt poking session when you're in jail and everybody's all fucking being stupid and, um, the guards are fucking, uh, mentally and physically, uh, traumatizing the people for, um, acting out about, uh, the piss poor treatment inside and all sorts of shit like that. Torture, religious freedom, force, corruption. They're always torturing people in jails. I've been tortured, but why should I go into what I've been, the ways I've been tortured? I've been tortured. Force, they always like to use force to make people comply. If you don't, if you don't treat them like they're gods and they make you comply. Corruption, they have corruption, violence, poor living conditions, and disenfranchisement. Like when they can't count your head like a chicken, that's that's being disenfranchised when they count your head like a chicken and make you stand in a single file line to, to get your chow like, 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 like you have no dignity. That's why people, that's why it's not corrections because they say, oh, if you didn't want to do it, you didn't, well, why didn't you go to jail? Well, I went to jail for filming in a public area and the ignorance of the um, law enforcement officer arrested me for trespassing when I was in a public building and I had a right to be there. This is why, oh, if you didn't like it, you shouldn't have went to jail. Well, I'm not, I'm not in here for breaking the law. I'm in here for the feelings of some cretin law enforcement officer, dude, public service agent that doesn't even know his own ethics or, or why would he even care because they just like being violent. That was back in the 90s when there was no cameras to catch them at every freaking turn. Now they're all crybabies because they can't force people and corrupt people, violence people, create poor living conditions. They love it when they can create poor living conditions. They let it go for as long as they can. And then they clean up their act and act like, oh, well, well we were just trying to clean up our act the whole time. Jail is so nasty and not because the prisoners in it but because and I call I, I said prisoners but I don't believe they're prisoners they're humans I, I'm tired of people calling them inmates I'm tired of people calling them prisoners I'm tired of people calling people felons and then seeking to deprive them of rights human rights that they have whether they're a felon or not you freaking childish people that have that are trying to force this stuff upon people need to be stopped by any means necessary as soon as possible this is a Cretans thing to do with these people, uh, treating them like they're not humans, treating them like they they keep calling them prisoners, keep calling them out of their out of their beings, not giving them the dignity and respect, counting their heads like chickens. It's all a bad thing. <laughs>